Hello viewers! Um, as you can see, the sun has actually come out and uh, I have made progress. I'm still out in the middle of the primeval forest. Um, got some nice padding made out of old stump. Um, but as you may hear, we also have a really nice waterfall. I mean, it's not a huge waterfall or anything, but it's a waterfall. It's pretty. I'm zooming a bit. Ooh, the power of gravity and hydrogen oxide. I mean, overall, I would definitely say this has not been the easiest trip I've had since coming to Japan. But it's definitely stunning. If you like nature, I'm sure many of you do. At least those of you who actually get off YouTube and go outside every now and then. Um, <laughs> if you like nature, this is definitely somewhere to, that is worth hitting up on your travels around the world. Assuming you travel around the world. Or, you know, if you're Japanese and watching this, konnichiwa, uh, then your travels in Japan. Uh, so let's, let's try and have the camera out for a bit, we'll see. Crap. Uh, <laughs> let's see what I can do. Yeah, that's the path. You can see it's the path because there's little pink ribbons. So, from my destroyed map that I was trying to take a look at at one point while the camera was off, seems like there's a little up to about 300 meters, and then a down to about 200 meters, and then an up to about 800 meters. Now I don't know if that 800 meters is actually on the path or just in the general area around the path, but I think I'm in the general 800 meter area now. Which means, as you can guess, it's been a lot more up recently than down. Uh, I'd show you on the map, but it's pretty trashed, and I don't think I have enough hands to show it anyway. Oh boy. It's just very... Na you know what? Sorry, camera's going away again. I'll be back. <laughs> 